Good evening, everybody. Uh, we've got June 30th looking at, halfway through the year, and we've got some exciting, maybe not exciting, interesting. We've got some interesting stuff to talk about. Because it's uh, midpoint of the year, and it's also the month of uh, sales tax reflected for April, which was Eclipse Day. I'm sure we all remember. Mm -hmm. And I think you guys have already heard our sales tax was flat for the month, which was kind of surprising, kind of not. I mean, if you looked around town, it not surprising, but we were expecting it to be a much bigger day. I dug in a little bit deeper in the sales tax numbers as far as what the state can provide us, and that is sales tax collections by business category. Um, and I looked at the categories that I thought would be most effective or most relatable to tourism, we'll say. So I looked at restaurants, gas stations. I looked at general merchandise just because it's a large category. I think that's where your Walmarts and Target report because it's it's over a half million dollars a month in that category. And then I looked at hotels and it's some were slightly down, some were slightly up. So you could look at those and you could say, okay, I could see where overall our sales tax would be flat. It was interesting, restaurants were actually down 2%. Um, hotels were down one. Uh, I guess they were all down except gas stations. Gas stations was up 2%. So. Do with that what you will, but that's that's the numbers how they shook out. Um, year to date, we're still up about six percent in sales tax, so we're still in really good, still in really good shape. The other revenues um, halfway through the year, the franchise fees looks a little short. That's because we got that uh, payment just a little bit late, and those numbers got posted in July. So in the next month's financials, you'll see two months worth, and then. Our parks revenue looks really good. We've already collected 81% of the budget there, but I was looking back, that seems to be normal. Um, we'll probably have slower months towards the end of the year when programs slow down. So I think we're right on track there. Uh, overall, uh, right on track with our revenues. We've collected 51% of our budget. Expenditure-wise, everything is pretty in line too. The planning department is slightly above 50%, but that's because a large part of their budget is a renewal on their software, and it's over a hundred thousand dollars, and they've already that's due. I think in like I think we paid it in May, so it's due mid year. So that number will start to even out as we go on through the rest of the year as well. And uh, so our bottom line is not great, um, eight hundred fifty nine thousand net revenue. It would be better if we had those franchise fees counted in there, but overall, I think everything is. Is looking good for us in the general fund. Anybody have any questions or comments on general fund? We'll go on to the street fund. We'll hit all of our funds and talk about them a little bit since we're at the midpoint of the year. Uh, in the street fund, the revenue are turned back compared to budgets kind of all over the map. I'm sure it's not hard to, to see that. Um, earlier in the year, I mentioned to you the turn back other category. There's really not much money coming into it anymore now that the half cent sales tax became permanent. The state's remitting all that to us in just the general turn back category. So we'll be mindful of that in future budgets. And then our severance tax has kind of slowed down on us again. You know, it, it got down so low there for several years, we just budgeted zero. And if we got any <coughs> severance tax money, it was, it was just cushioned. And then we had a couple of good years in 22, we collected almost $400,000, and in 23, we collected about 130, and we decided to start putting some budget back in to account for, you know, revenues of that size, and we plugged in 200,000, and we've only collected 20% of that budget so far this year. So we'll discuss it when it comes budget time, but maybe for a 25 budget, we just lump all the turn back stuff together and just count it as one number. The municipal league gives us just one number as far as a projection of what the turn back revenue is going to be. And then as the state gives it to us, the state remits it to us in all these different categories. So we can talk about how we best want to handle that. But uh, either way, overall, the, the turn back is right on track. Um, and you can see our expenditures. Uh, we're tracking below budget there. So the street fund appears to be in good shape halfway through the year. Any questions or comments on street fund? Moving on to sanitation. The uh, collection fees, that first 
revenue line item, 53% of the budget collected, so we're right on track there. It uh, looks like another good year for the sale of recyclables. Uh, all of our revenue is really tracking ahead of schedule. And then all of our expenditure categories are below as well, so it's been a really good year so far in sanitation. Any questions or comments there? Last operating fund we have is the airport. Airport got off to a little bit of a rough start this year with the winter weather. Uh, you can see our fuel sales are uh, at 36% where we'd expect them to be at about 50. Uh, hopefully between now and the end of the year we can make up some of that ground, but it, we're probably not gonna hit that budget number and hopefully we don't miss it by much. All of our other revenues uh, are in good, good positions there. And then the expenditures appear to either be on track or below budgeted levels. So the airport fund seems to be like the others and in good shape. So overall, I like where we are. I hope you do too. That's all I've got, Mary. It's like Mr. Fulton is still our friend. Yes, very much. <laughs> Any questions for Mr. Bunningham? Good job. Thank you. As always. A motion count make a motion for the approval of the financials for june second I have a motion and a second to approve the monthly financials any further discussion mr garrett all in favor say aye aye, aye. aye. all opposed that's a six zero thank you mr winningham